In the first part of the series, we will discuss on the virological aspects of SARS-CoV-2. SARS-CoV-2 comes under the beta subgroup of the Orthocoronavirinae subfamily of the Coronaviridae family under the order Nilovirales. Coronaviruses commonly infect rodents and bats. Human infections occur as a result of cross-species infection either directly or through an intermediary host. In majority of the cases, the primary portal of entry remains respiratory. However, all organ systems can be affected by coronavirus. Coronavirus is a spherical enveloped virus that measures 50 to 200 nanometer. They have crown-like spikes on the outer surface which gives them the name Corona. Among several proteins found in SARS-CoV-2 virus, there are four key proteins that are important. The spike protein or the X protein helps in attaching the virus to the ACE2 receptors of the human cells. It has a distal S1 segment which acts as the receptor binding domain and a proximal S2 which helps in viral fusion with the cell membrane. Spike protein is responsible for the infectivity, virulence and tissue tropism. The membrane protein or the M protein is the main structural protein and provides shape to the virus. It has an N-terminal ectodomain, a transmembrane domain and a C-terminal domain. It helps in viral assembly, budding and envelope formation. The envelope protein or the E protein is found amidst the lipid bilayer and helps in production and maturation of the virus. Finally, the nucleocapsid protein or the N protein holds the RNA genome together. It facilitates viral replication and also plays a key role in cellular response of host to the viral infection. The genomic material of SARS-CoV-2 comprises of a single stranded RNA which codes for several structural and non-structural proteins. Coronaviruses are known to have caused pandemics even before. Severe acute respiratory syndrome following SARS coronavirus 1 was reported between 2002 to 2003 where transmission from bats to civet and cross species infection to humans affected almost 8000 people with 10% mortality. Similarly, in 2012, the Middle Eastern respiratory syndrome where the transmission occurred from bat to camel and then to human affected nearly 2,500 people with 35% mortality. SARS-CoV-2 is a novel strain of coronavirus which was reported in late December 2019 from Wuhan, China from a seafood market. SARS-CoV-2 has a close genomic similarity with bat coronaviruses. It has 80% similarity to SARS-CoV-1 and 55% similarity to Middle Eastern respiratory virus. The origin of SARS-CoV-2 virus still remains controversial. It could occur due to a natural spillover into human such as an encounter at a natural habitat or within human habitat. It could also be lab associated where contamination of sample tested in labs could have led to viral propagation. Viral genome manipulation is another hypothesis that needs to be proved. The first case of coronavirus disease occurred in December 8, 2019. Following this, China alerted WHO about severe pneumonia cases spreading in its province. In January 7, 2020, the novel coronavirus was identified. Soon, the first death of coronavirus was reported in Jan 11 and coronavirus was started to be reported outside China, first in Thailand. In Jan 23, the people of Wuhan were quarantined. Coronavirus started spreading worldwide and WHO declared COVID-19 as a pandemic in March 11, 2020. In April 2, 2020, there were more than a million cases who were confirmed of COVID-19 the global death due to COVID was more than 1 lakh. Since then, 
covid has affected almost all countries and no region has remained unspared of covid the entire world is trying its best to tackle the waves of coronavirus and are trying to mitigate deaths from SARS-CoV-2 infection if you like these videos please subscribe us and follow us for new updates